What happened at the Somme? Bloody battles are what people remember most about the First World War. One such battle is the Battle of the Somme, perhaps the bloodiest battle of the whole war. Now I should explain to you what bloodiest means in this context. It means like most amount of people killed, most blood caused. On these pages you'll find different boxes containing information about the battle. Your job is to analyse the information and build a picture of what happened. Source A. British troops make their way towards the enemy during the Battle of the Somme. Why did the battle happen? At 7.30am on the 1st of July 1916, the Allies began an attack on enemy trenches that were positioned near the River Somme in France. The following battle lasted for 140 days. The purpose of the battle was to capture completely the German trenches at Beaumont Hamel. Before they started, the British and French spent a week heavily firing shells and detonating mines to destroy the German line. The idea was that when it came to the start of the battle, the Germans would already be vastly weakened. What happened next? On June, in June 1916, we were rushed to France for a big attack to liberate the French at Verdun. This, they were getting a real doing and we had to make a diversion. At the start, we were lined up ready to go over. At the whistle, at half seven, a huge mine went off to the right. It went off too soon and it gave the Germans a chance to come out of their deep dugouts and to concentrate on us. I think they were surprised to see us walking. In our orders we had to walk across. We had been led to believe by higher ups, they mean like generals, that the big bombardment over the days and nights had obliterated, that means to destroy, the enemy. But we knew it hadn't because their positions were so strong. Their dugouts were way under the parapets of the trenches and they couldn't be reached by our artillery fire. All they did was wait down there until our barrage lifted. A barrage is like lots of shots being fired. And then they came up to have some target practice at us. We were held up by huge coils of barbed wire. And in the odd gap that we made, for we were greeted by their heavy machine guns. Saucy, Private Frank Lindsay of the 14th Battalion, York and Lancaster Regiment, describes his experience of the Somme. Important facts. The German trenches were well designed and had numerous deep shelters. Many shells failed to explode and those designed to cut all the barbed wire protecting the German lines weren't up to the job. The German forces were learning from previous attacks. Major bombardments usually ended just before the British troops went over the top. So they, so when the weak long shelling stopped, the Germans rushed from their shelters, put machine guns in position and were ready and waiting. The British soldiers, many of whom were those who had volunteered in 1914 and 15, had never faced a real battle before. British soldiers met fierce resistance from the German troops. Source E. A famous still, that means a photograph, um, taken from the film The Battle of the Somme. What is happening in this picture? Why do you think it has become so famous? Then in source D. Statistics showing the outcome of the battle. 40,000 wounded on the first day. 20,000 dead on the first day. 415,000 British casualties in total. 200,000 French casualties in total. 600,000 German casualties in total. The Allies had advanced their front lines five miles. Beaumont Hamel was captured in November 1916.